family! God bless you all. Thank y'all for tuning in for today's Prophet Tour. And today we are at Bum -ba -dum, 5613 Montclair Drive here in Colleyville, Texas. Gonna be checking out this beautiful estate. This is a 2018 custom home. And this is going to be a five bedroom, five bathroom, three car garage, 4,764 square feet. Beautiful home. Now this is going to be in really prime time area, guys, in Coleyville. So super easy access to the tollways, restaurants, dining. Um, you got the Dallas Fort Worth Airport you know, at arm's reach. And so, really excited to show you all this beautiful home. Today, the wifey is not joining us, which, sad face, guys. <laughs> Love it when the wife joins, but she decided to kick it back at the house today, relax, kick her feet up, and hang out with the doggos. So, all right, guys, so as soon as we enter, um, well, actually, if you're here with us right now, be sure to hit that thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And stay tuned for the good news towards the end of the video. You don't want to miss the good news, my friends. That's the best part of these videos. Gorgeous floating staircase. Got this really nice open concept. Look at this. Beautiful. Gorgeous living room. You got these really nice wooden beams up on the ceilings there. Got kind of like a nice uh, stone exterior fireplace. Look at that. And beautiful. Loving how the kitchen is tucked away over there. And then got this really nice view of the pool back here, which is uh, a must have out here in good old Dallas, Texas. Which, uh, by the way, guys, um, for all my people coming out to Tejas, um, we do get some people that reach out from like California and New York, like wanting to move to Dallas. And they're like, Man, I just can't move to Dallas because it's, it's always hot over there. It's always hot in Texas. Guys, that is far from the truth, guys. Um, yes, summer months can get very, very caliente. Like, you guys are probably going to want to wear, like, tank tops all throughout the summer months. But now that we're in the winter time frame, I'm telling you guys, it is nice, breezy. I think it's, like, 65 degrees outside right now. So... I'm actually wearing a, a sweater today, which is unusual. Um, but anyways, guys, we got the, the owner suite here. Got these really nice uh, glass windows back there. Got some really beautiful lighting up on the ceilings. Gorgeous modern fan. And really spacious. And I love the fact that you can access your, your pool from here. Really nice. Got some mature trees back here. Gorgeous pool. Got a nice little outdoor kitchen set up. Got some nice separation between you and the neighbors. Um, nice size lot. And beautiful, huge master bedroom. And by the way, guys, just a quick uh, market status update, y'all. Um, you know, so right now, a lot of sellers and builders are, I mean, they're slashing prices left to right. Um, they're buying down interest rates. They're giving closing cost incentives. And uh, it's a really great time to just uh, take advantage of some of these incentives that have been going on. Um, but, you know, a lot of people decided to, to maybe hold off a little bit till after, you know, maybe next year. But just a heads up, guys, right now that it's the winter months, Typically, a lot of sellers and builders, they see a big, big decrease in, in obviously, in volume and, and not as many offers and everything like that. So, um, they start to make things more enticing. So, right now, they're literally, I mean, I have a client right now, um, you know, by God's grace, hopefully it works out. Um, but super sweet family, they... Uh, are gonna have potentially the builders, which they're talking to management today, gonna be buying down their interest rate to like 4.8, somewhere around there, which I think is pretty crazy. Um, 
and they're going to be giving them some closing cost incentives and all that good stuff so just a heads up guys just a little market update obviously with interest rates being at an all-time high well not all-time high they've been you know really high back in the day but now that prices are pretty high and interest rates it's really pulling back a lot of people from the market but uh that's how builders and sellers are starting to combat and help buyers out so it is now a buyer's market which is awesome okay got this beautiful massive kitchen here huge island gorgeous light fixtures look at that and wow, okay, I've never seen a fridge like this. This is pretty cool. So I'm assuming one is a freezer, the other one's a fridge. And they also have a little butler's pantry back here. Our, got this nice, really top of the line, Thermador appliances. If you all know anything about appliances when it comes to Thermador, they are top notch. Got the six burner gas grill farmhouse sink wow loving that and then you got a uh, your little uh, kind of dining area here loving how there's so many windows so gives you that that nice view especially when you have the familia over you got Thanksgiving going on Christmas parties really nice um, to overlook the backyard maybe here grilling up some fajitas or some steaks so all right beautiful countertops i think these are going to be granite if i'm not mistaken yeah these days might just be granite but got a nice little sink here overlooking the side here and they do have a, a full-on abuela suite right there um got the double oven here And let's actually sneak on our way over here. So, wow, look at this. Beautiful. I'm seeing a lot of more homes with that lighting under the cabinets, which I'm not sure. How do you guys feel about that? How do you guys feel about the lighting under, you know, cabinets like this? I personally really love it. It just makes everything pop. And then this is gonna be kind of like a little office, study room. Got some nice fi light fixtures. Got the uh, nice little view of the front yard here. Okay. And then got a nice little walk-in closet here. And the cool thing is that Abuela actually has her own, like, her own full on I think this is I think it might let me see actually I'm not sure guys let's let's double check here when we get there washroom washer and dryer LG appliances lots of cabinets here and then I'm assuming this is just going to be some extra storage here yeah and then right over here you're going to have some additional parking Garage is gonna be over here and then I think this might just be locked guys. Oh, man Can't get in here. There might they might be using it as storage, but that's possibly gonna be like a room or something um, But gates gonna be over here, which is pretty cool So you could probably fit maybe like one two three four maybe about I would say like four or five cars, you know So that's gonna be an additional room there, but I think they might just be using that as storage Okay, guys, sorry about that. The, the door lock was spazzing out for a little bit. <laughs> um, okay, so let's head on over here before we go upstairs. And we got another half bathroom here. Single vanity. This is for the when the familia comes over and you don't want them to use your bed, bathroom. Got a nice little hangout spot here. Um, you could set up like a TV, you know, play the game, you know, you have access to your little grill out station here, access to the pool, so you can be cooking up some, some nice ribeye steaks and hanging out with 
the wife, the friends, you know, maybe having some nice little red wine. And then this is gonna be your little wine cellar, which is pretty cool. Look at that. They did a fantastic job. And then wine fridge here. What do you guys think so far? Comment down below your thoughts on this home. Um, I'm loving it, guys. Most importantly, I love location. It is a really great location. Like I was saying earlier, it's super convenient to, to everything. So, mud room here. Alarm system. And then, two-car garage here. All right. Got the nice epoxy flooring there. And then, let me show you guys real quickly. Little kitchen setup back here. Oof. So, nice little kitchen. Got your grill out here. Got an asada approved, guys. So, it's really, really nice. Very peaceful back here. Got a nice little yard space. Maybe set up like a little playground for the kiddos. Um, they do also have kind of like a little security to enter the pool, which is pretty cool. All right. Okay, guys. Now let's head on upstairs. Actually, really impressed with the size of the, this home. And this is actually also going to be your nice little... Oh, give me one second, guys. We're having technical difficulties. Oh, there you go. All right. So back here, got a nice little hangout spot. Got the fireplace, the plasma screen TV. Play the games. Have the kids running around. Barbecues. All right. And then let's head on upstairs. What do you guys think so far? Yay or nay, guys? Do y'all like this property? What do you guys think? Whew. All right, let's head on upstairs. I really love these floating staircases. I think they did a fantastic job. It's like not in the way. It's kind of tucked away here on the side, so. All right, let's see, which one do we want to knock out first? Let's head on over here. So this is gonna be little Jacob's room. All right, overlooking the front yard there. Got a full bathroom here, really nice. Single vanity, lots of cabinet space, and then got a nice, beautiful stand-up shower. You know, actually, I, I, it, it doesn't feel like it's a 2018 build, to be honest, guys. Like, I think, like, this, this feels pretty, pretty dang spanking new. Like, this looks a lot better than a lot of the new custom builds that I've been seeing on the market. So, attic is going to be over here. And then... Nice little hallway. Got a little Jesse's room here. Gorgeous light fixtures. Got a full bathroom. Really nice. By the way, guys, if y'all want to see some additional property tours, guys, maybe some short snippets. Um, or if you guys want to reach out, you're looking to move to the Dallas Fort Worth area or Houston, San Antonio. My wife and I primarily handle the Dallas Fort Worth area, but we do have other team members, um, in the company. And so you guys can check us out on Instagrammies. You guys can find us on here. We're always posting cool property tours on here and whatnot. So, and then if you wanted to look at different properties, you guys wanted to check out some homes, then you guys can go on our website here visit our website to browse homes and you guys can look at different properties. 
here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, we did uh, just release it by God's grace. Praise the Lord. Everything went well on the website, so it did get released. So it helps a lot of people um, just kind of see what's out in the market. So we got double closets here, which is pretty cool. All right. Well, there you have it, guys. Let me know what you guys think about this beautiful property tour. Um, as always, my friends, this is the listing. Um, I am going to put it in the description. Like I said, Scott Schultz is the listing agent, so that's going to be his information there. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. As always, subscribe. Hit that thumbs up. And we got some good news headed your way, my friends. So hold on tight. Don't you leave this video just yet, guys, because... Got some good news to share with you guys in the car. So we'll see you guys in three, two, one. Let's go. Shalom, family. God bless you all. Here with the beautiful wifey. Glad to be back. Glad to be back, wife. You weren't here at today's property tour. We missed you. Um, like I always say, guys, it is just not the same not having her alongside two of these properties. But rest assured, guys. We're always going to be here together delivering the best part of these videos, Amen. the most important part of these videos, which is the good news, my friends. So if you're here with us right now, we are excited to present the good news because this good news is good for you, for me, and for everybody. So, John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. My friends, these homes are gorgeous. The properties that you see, you know, on our channel are absolutely breathtaking right mm -hmm. i mean such god-given talent mm -hmm. the builders yeah. architects i mean you would be surprised how many people are involved into building some of these homes it is incredible designers construction workers the, the porn the cement so many people involved the guys fact that they all come in unity to create this beautiful picture is incredible it's amazing guys and you know by god's grace we have been you know, he's been opening doors. We've been seeing even more oh, awesome homes that are just fantastic. But, but guys, here's the reality of it, okay? We want to reel you guys back in because I'm sure we all had a good time looking at these properties. But here it is. They're temporary, okay? I want you guys to understand this. I want you guys to realize that, yes, these homes are gorgeous. Not to say you can't have these nice things, but there is an eternal home. That is non-perishable, non-perishable guys. That is from everlasting to everlasting. And this home has already been paid for. So there is no credit check. There is no income. There is no W-2s, tax returns. You don't have to have a loan officer check your credit and all that stuff. Because this loan has been paid in full on that cross at Calvary. Okay. Where Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, shed his precious blood for sinners like us, guys. And if we repent and trust in him... Okay we will have eternal life my friends mm -hmm. all right and that is the good news my friends that god loved us so much he sent his only son guys for you and for me and for everybody right the gospel's for everybody mm -hmm. and it's that easy all you have to do is literally just repent and trust in jesus because he already did the hard part you know it's just following him at this point following him to the very end guys and rest assured as you start to dive into the scriptures you start to really um really soak in you know what christ and 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 what he's taught us in scripture mm -hmm. and you start to apply that to your life rest assured guys you will start to see just the light right you will start to walk in in, in the light you'll start to see okay wow this is you know some of these things I, I need to stay away from you know some of these people i probably shouldn't be um hanging around with because of the influences that they're bringing mm -hmm. um some of the th these things that i'm watching online i probably shouldn't be watching you start to slowly feel convicted more and mm -hmm. more right god will start sanctifying you from inside of yourself and you won't even know and you'll be a completely different person before you know it yeah and and here's a little personal testimony when when we first came to the lord like truly came to lord mm -hmm. jesus christ in repentance um we started to really feel convicted on a lot of the things that yeah. we were doing. The way we were speaking, you know, we were cussing before. We were watching. Oh, my gosh. You know, we used to cuss. I mean, guys, think about it. Well, we yeah. used to cuss a lot, you know. And um, we were watching not-so-great things. We were hanging around doing 
not so great uh, yeah. substances and whatnot, you know, but rest assured God delivered us from that, right? And he's still helping us. I mean, we're not perfect. We're still, we still have things that we need to work on, but rest assured guys, Jesus Christ will be with us. He will guide us. He will lead us, my friends. It doesn't so. happen overnight, guys. It's a process. It's a walk with Christ. You have to seek him and he will continue to sanctify you. And it's beautiful. It's beautiful to look back and be like, can you believe like we were such individuals back then and now we're like completely different by the grace of god yeah and and sometimes we'll we'll scroll through our old photos and be like oh my god just cringe cringe like, like you remember oh, dude yes exactly who you were at that time and to just see who we are now it's just it's all for his glory at the end of the day it's all for his glory he my friends is the way the truth and the life mm -hmm. my friends he is the perfect example Okay, don't look at us as examples. Yeah. Don't look at man for examples because we are all fallen, mm -hmm. guys. All of us. The Bible says that none are righteous. We have all fallen short of the glory of God, guys. The true example, the only example is Jesus Christ, okay? Human will always disappoint you. Like, we, we disappoint each other. Like, that will always be a thing. But the only one that doesn't is Jesus. And like, he, he doesn't change. Yep. And he will fulfill us. He is the living water. The Bible says that he who comes to me will never be thirsty, will never be hungry. Okay. And when you when you bring him into your life, you accept him as your Lord and Savior, guys. Rest assured, you'll see a big change in your life. All right. Those heavy burdens, you know. The Bible says, come to me, all who are heavy burdened, right, or weary. You know, he will bring you peace. He is the Prince of Peace, my friends. So we're crying out to you, you know. Cool. These properties are awesome. Yes, this is what we do as a... Yeah. This is our job, you know, we're realtors, but you know, forget about that. This is the most important things of these videos is the good news and, and what Jesus Christ did on that cross at Calvary, <laughs> guys. Okay, he loves you and um, he's calling you right now to repentance. Um, we got the neighborhood kids running around, so they're like around our car right now. Like, what are these guys doing? Um, but anyways, guys, God bless you and your families. I want to leave you guys with a piece of scripture before we head out. Um, so... This is 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 14. Either way, Christ loves, love controls us. Since we believe that Christ died for all, we also believe that he had all died to our old life. He died for everyone so that those who receive his new life will no longer live for themselves. Instead, they will live for Christ who died and was raised for them. Amen. Putting off your old self. You live are now for live for Christ, guys. I was going to say, I encourage you guys, because this is our job. You know, our job is to, um, we're realtors, is to help people find homes. But I encourage you guys to preach the gospel in your job. Don't be afraid of letting people know what God did for you. You don't necessarily have to go in depth, but just sharing your testimony with people makes a huge difference. Because guys, in our industry as realtors, we meet a lot of different backgrounds, right? And we can't come in there hot and heavy like, yeah. hey, repent, Jesus Christ is king. Yeah. No, we have to show them love. We have to show them care. We have to tell them our testimony. And God will do the rest, mm -hmm. guys. We're here to plant the seed. He will bring the increase, guys. It's not our job to yeah. convert people. No, it, God is going to do the converting, mm -hmm. right? God will convict the heart. God will soften the heart. It's, it's our job to share the good news, yeah. right? There's so much power in the good news. Amen. Ooh, come on now. I gotta go, guys. <laughs> uh, but on a serious note, guys, God bless you and your family. Thank you guys for watching. As always, like my wife was saying, don't be ashamed of the gospel. You're gonna get a lot of pushback, especially in your jobs, like in our jobs, in our line of industry, we get a lot of pushback, but it's fine. It's okay. We don't that, forget about that. Remember, we're only here for a temporary, Tempor temporary amount of time. And okay. like scripture says, live for Christ. Everything you do, do it for the Lord. Do it all for the glory of God everything guys all right he loves you today can be the day of salvation the free gift of god through jesus christ and through jesus christ alone um he is the way the truth and the life my friends so today you can accept them into your life he will bring you peace and rest assured he will bring you the most joy that no worldly possession can ever bring guys mm -hmm. that's a mic drop right there <laughs> we gotta go because it's about to get hot and heavy in here and i'm sweating <laughs> i know right we gotta turn on the ac because it's hot uh but god bless you guys thank you guys for watching um as always um thank you god bless bye